Hello guys, welcome to another vlog of a family pack. This is our first vlog and it's a super special one because we're getting a puppy. <laughs> Julian sleeping in the other room and he has no idea. Yeah, we're getting another Aussie doodle like Charlie. Um, it's a girl this time. Her name is Maggie and we're getting her from the same breeder as Charlie. So for today's vlog, I decided to uh, show you guys uh, the things to do and, and the stuff to get before you get a puppy so you're ready and when your puppy comes home, uh, you don't have to rush. So let's drop to the pet store. <laughs> back from the store and these are the things that we got uh, these are the essential things that I think you need for your new puppy uh, we got a cage a bed toys a leash and a collar uh, some of the things that we didn't get because we already had was a bowl for food and uh, for water uh, as well as dog food other additional items that I recommend uh, to get for your pet are the following. Number seven, we have uh, shampoo. This shampoo will leave your pet soft and clean for sure, and it's absolutely my favorite. Uh, number eight, uh, we have uh, uh, dog cologne or uh, freshener, and it, it will make your pet smells good even on the uh, wettest and dirtiest day outside. Uh, number nine, we have the wipes. These wipes are great uh, for when your dog gets dirty. Uh, it's always good to have them. Uh, number 10, we have treats. And these are my favorite treats, but you can have uh, whatever you desire. Uh, at number 11, uh, we have the always useful uh, dog food bags. And you'll need this one for when you're taking your push on a walk. Alrighty guys, I think we are pretty much ready for the puppy. Uh, this is where she's gonna sleep in. I've decided to put Charlie's bed right next to her uh, so that he can sleep next to her and uh, she won't be afraid. Puppies usually whine at night either because they want to go out or um, because they miss their siblings and want something or someone to be right next to them. So that's going to be Charlie's job in the first few nights getting her uh, costume to be in here and uh, he's already doing a great job. of the video I'm actually not gonna cook a meal for us I'm gonna show you what we do for Charlie and he's on a raw food diet so we're gonna start with giving him some chicken gizzards and chicken feet and I have some chicken liver left over from the other day and whoop, an egg too for some variety we're actually gonna give him just a little bit of all of this to make his meal I'm only gonna take out uh, about half of the gizzards here. I'm gonna break it up. They are still frozen, but it, it's okay. So half the gizzards, I'm actually gonna uh, put the egg. I mean, we're gonna put the shell in there for some added calcium. Break it up into fine pieces. Okay, I'm not gonna put all of it. I thought I had used more. I'm just gonna put two pieces of liver. And then we've got the chicken. 
chicken feet. Charlie really likes the chicken feet. I'm still gonna like mix it all in. Alrighty guys, we are pretty much ready now. We're about to go to bed and we are gonna get up early tomorrow and take Julian with us to pick up Maggie. It's a surprise he doesn't know yet. to Maggie's house. We're in the country, y'all. Ha <laughs> ha. 